executing against the zone where you looks like you got a lot of open threes. Were you happy with the way you guys moved the ball? Uh, we knew we were going to get uh, open shots from the perimeter. Uh, our goal was to get as many paint touches as we could early, but we came out shooting the ball well, so that's kind of what fell fell back on at times. But we did get the ball to high post a couple times, and we got good things from it. Defensively, talk about kind of regaining that identity over the last couple of ball games, uh, holding both you and I and, and Illinois State tonight to right around 33%. Uh, it's something we can talk about every day. Uh, want to get better defensively, want to get better defensively, want to get better defensively. It's said more than once daily. Uh, so when we come out, that's what we're focusing on. And uh, we got on brand tonight, and uh, I don't know how many transition points we had, but there's quite a few that we relied on and got some easy layups. Well, how important was it not to turn the ball over against their press? And I'm sure they used that to get a lot of offense. They didn't get many easy points at all. Uh, yeah, they, they were doing that three-quarter court, uh, two-two-one, and they wanted to slow us down and uh, kind of. It's kind of an off, it's awkward press. Uh, it's, they get a lot of freedom as far as their guards uh, trapping whenever they want. Uh, we handled it well and got a nice flash in the middle, and uh, we were either to slice their press and get some easy shots and worked out for us. Anything else for Ron? Ron, you're a native of Kent. Three Kansas teams in the top 25 led by you guys. Does it mean anything to you to be from a basketball state to help keep building this tradition of being a basketball state in Kansas? Uh, I think being a part of it is something pretty special. Uh, I work camps with all the players in the state this, this past summer and we're, I was able to build a friendship with Will Spradley, and Brandon Green, and Frank Mason, those type of guys. And, uh, they're great kids, and uh, we're, we're here to play basketball in Kansas. And for us to represent those three teams, uh, it means a lot to us. And for us to be in that top 25, and it looks good for the state and for us individually. Is this kind of what you hope for when you're growing up in Kansas, is a, to be a part of this type of deal? Yeah, I, I didn't expect to be here growing up, but uh, if you would have told me I'd been in this situation when I was younger, it would have put a pretty big smile on my face.